Hey, what is going on guys? It is Brendan, aka Triple D, and I am back with another story time. So, I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day so far. I know I am. I'm here best. Tell a fucking story time to you guys. And I hope you guys enjoy it. Leave a like because I'm not asking at the end of the video anymore. Uh, leave a like or I'm going to literally eat your grandma's ashes. But uh, yeah, let's hop into it. So, with this story time, it all happens on a normal day. It all happens back in fourth grade. And in fourth grade, I went to daycare. A public daycare. Because my parents worked all the time. And it was pretty cool. I met some of my closest friends through daycare. Shout out to my homies who know. And, uh, yeah. So, a normal day, it was kind of snowing outside. And back in the day we used to get a shit ton of snow up here and so i'm sitting there chilling at daycare i had my ds my action replay and fucking pokemon heart gold and it was chilling me and the boys we were playing fucking cheating on that shit and we were battling the shit out of each other and to say the least i was kicking some ass and there's a weird kid we're just gonna call him eugene because that's what the weird kids are known as being and uh at a moment's notice, this man was reaching into his bag and we're all running away. But, that didn't happen on this day. In fact, it didn't happen at all. And so we're all chilling, playing Pokemon, just having a good ass time. And the daycare ladies, they were kind of, they were kind of weird. Like, if you had a DS and none of the other kids did, you had to share it with them. Which I think was bullshit because, first of all, it's mine. Second of all, some... Fucking hot Cheeto fucking powder having ass. Kids are going to get that shit all over my DS. They're going to break my shit. They're going to make it all nasty and shit. So I just didn't like sharing my shit. Like, call me a brat for that, but it's literally mine. Uh, your parents can afford to put you in a daycare. They can afford to get you a fucking DS. But, so I had to share my DS. And on this day, I was like, alright, well... Since I'm sharing it and I'm bored of shit, I'm just going to go to the bathroom. So I go to the bathroom with two of my friends. And one of my friends is playing my DS. I'm like, alright, cool. Uh, John, you watch out for my shit. I'm going to go potty. He's like, yeah. So I go potty. And we're all chilling in the bathroom. Just fucking around. Being little kids. We're like throwing wet ass toilet paper wads at the bathroom wall. And just having a good ass time in general. Uh, we ended up flooding the shit out of the toilet. And that shit like went all, all over the ground. And, uh, yeah. So, anyways, we're all, like, just fucking around. We ended up getting in trouble for that. But, uh, anyways, we come back to the bathroom. Back from the bathroom. Sorry about that, guys. Kind of stuttering, kind of eating some hot wings right now, you know. Had to pause for the video. But, uh, so, we get back from the bathroom, and we got yelled at because the teachers liked to check in the bathrooms after we went. Because... They were weird like that. And so we got yelled at for it. Had to go in timeout. So I go up to my friend John. I'm like, yo, where's my DS? And he's like, yo, I let that kid borrow it. I'm like, seriously, man, you let another kid borrow my shit? He's like, yeah, man, my bad. I'm like, uh, no worries. Who'd you lend it to? He's like, oh, I lent it to uh, Ethan. I'm like, oh, okay. So I go over to Ethan. I'm like, yo, man, do you have my DS? And then he was like, uh, no, I don't. I lent it to someone else. I'm like, fuck, who'd you lend it to? He was like, oh, I actually don't know. I was like, what the fuck? So, I'm a little bit upset at this point. I lost my DS, and that shit gone. So, I go up to the teacher. I'm like, hey, someone has my DS. Can you guys check the backpacks? And so, they started checking the backpacks. And no one had my DS. So, I was a little bit upset. Like, I was fucking fuming, bro. Like, that was my shit. Someone stole it. Someone robbed me, bro. And they took my fucking action replay. So, me being a little kid, I immediately assumed that it was fucking Eugene. The weirdo from earlier in the story time. I'm like, Eugene has it. I swear. But, there was no proof on him. Anyways, a week goes by. I still didn't have my DS. It was kind of sad, kind of like a lost cause at this point, because that shit was gone for more than a week. It's like when a when a person goes missing after the first 48 hours, like, all chances go down the fucking drain. So, I'm over it at this point, and 
I'm chilling. The one day, Eugene magically comes to school with a DS. I'm like, yo, when this will get a DS? And his DS is all weird. Like, it's not like the normal, like, white, like all of ours were. His was like black, but it looks like it was drawn on someone. Hmm. I wonder. And my DS had like a certain scratch mark on the screen, like the bottom screen. So I'm like, hmm, I wonder. So I uh, I go up to him. I'm like, hey, Ethan, can I play? No, not Ethan. Hey, Eugene, can I play on your DS? He's like, no, it's mine. I'm like, okay, motherfucker, I see you. So I go up to the teacher. I'm like, hey, I don't have a DS. And Eugene does. I want to play on his. And they're like, okay. So th they go to try to get Eugene to give it up. And Eugene is just throwing a fucking fit. He's like, no, it's mine. I'm not giving it to him. But to say the least, they, uh, they just didn't get it from him. I'm like, okay, what the fuck? They, like, take it from me, but they're not going to take it from this weird-ass kid. So anyways, Eugene, he, uh, he's, like, looking around because... I'm pretty sure his DS died, so he's like looking around, going over to the outlets, like getting ready to charge that shit. I'm like, okay, what the fuck? So he plugs it in, and then he goes to the bathroom. I'm like, all right, now's my time. So I go, and I like start sneaking over by his DS, and the teacher's like, uh, Brendan, what are you doing? I'm like, uh, j just hold on, shut up, just watch. And they're like, uh, Brendan, you shouldn't be doing that. I'm like, no, wait. So I go over to his DS and the teachers are like telling me to stop. And I'm like, no, I got to fucking make sure you guys aren't doing your job. I, I'm going to do it for you guys. I flip open his shit and the scratch mark is right there on the fucking screen. And I'm like, yo, this is mine. And they're like, how do you know? And I tell them, I'm like, the same scratch mark. They're like, do you have proof? And my homie had a 3DS, so he whips out a picture of my DS. Same scratch mark on the fucking bottom screen. And they're like, oh, I guess it is yours. Well, since it's there, we're going to have to wait until his parents come, and then your parents come, and then we'll sort it out. So Eugene's parents come and pick him up, and then my parents come. And before we both leave, because they picked us up at the same time, before we both leave, fucking Eugene's, like, freaking out. He's like, where's my DS? And the daycare ladies, they're, like, talking to his parents. They're like, we... We believe that Eugene stole Brendan's DS. And Eugene's like throwing a fit. He's like, no, it's mine. It's mine. And his parents were all like, Eugene, we never got you a DS. And he's like throwing a fucking fit. Just raging. Like, it's my DS. I swear. I swear. And he's like getting mad as shit. And the daycare ladies, they go to like give my fucking parents the DS. And Eugene snatches it out of their hands. And he's like, if no one can have it, no. He's like, if I can't have it, then no one can have it. And he picks up my DS, he fucking hangs it over his head, and he smashes that bitch on the ground. And we're all just saying their jaw drops. And I'm like, what the fuck did this kid just do? So I get all upset, and I'm like trying to fight this kid. And his parents are like yelling at him, and my parents are yelling at me and him. And I'm like, just piss. So... The daycare ladies were like, oh shit, something's about to go down. So they they eventually like split us up and my parents are like talking to his. And his parents were all like, well, we did just buy him a fucking 3DS and that was going to be for Christmas in two weeks. But since he wants to sit there and steal and break other kids things, he's not going to have it. In fact, we think we should just give it to your son. And yeah, they ended up giving it to me. So that was pretty cool. I got my DS stolen, broken, and I got a fucking new 3DS in return. So if there's a lesson to be learned, uh, don't be a fucking dumbass and steal from others. Don't be a piece of shit either. And more importantly, don't try to fight kids because they try to steal from you. And don't try to steal back. Just go to the fucking adults and let them handle it but uh yeah if you guys enjoyed this story time leave a like leave a comment down below if you guys have any similar story times and subscribe if you're not already subscribed i appreciate the shit out of that and yeah if you guys want to watch any of my similar story times those will be down in the description below anyways thank you guys for watching 
I'll see you guys later. Peace out.